one of the special privileges I have as a clinician is that I develop an incredibly close relationship with people over a very short period of time. We're dealing with heart issues here so often, you know, life and death issues. And obviously the whole relationship is based on trust, trust that we're going to do the very best for our patients. Um, the euthanasia debate or a euthanasia option really skews that whole treatment uh, possibilities in a significant way. It goes against all that I have been trained to do as a clinician. And I think it really destroys the whole trust relationship that we have uh, with patients. So as a clinician dealing with cancer patients um, who are vulnerable, I would want to uh, them to understand that I want to do the very, very best for them, that I want to travel with them in their uh, journey and give them the very best options for their treatment and that we will support them uh, if there is any suffering at all. And in that way, be positive about that journey rather than uh, negative, uh, as I would see you would be, with offering a euthanasia option. Uh, so from my personal view, that would make our work so much more difficult to do. It's already difficult enough uh, because it is very, very difficult for the patients to understand what we're talking about. Uh, and they really do trust us uh, to offer the very best that we can for them. Um, and I don't believe that uh, a euthanasia uh, option will aid that whole uh, debate in an honest way at all.